Do you know Khmer Shadow Theater? Tại nhà school là Khmer Shadow Spike Thom đại đại thế. Ta, em mời tao nghe. The Spike Thom is the Khmer Shadow Theater featuring two meter high, non-articulated puppets made of leather openwork. Dating from before the Angkorian period, the Spike Thom along with the Royal Ballet and Mask Theater is considered sacred. Dedicated to the divinities, performances could only take place on specific occasion three or four times a year, such as Khmer New Year, the King's Birthday, or the veneration of famous people. The performance is accompanied by an orchestra and two narrators. Inspired from the Rimke, the Khmer version of a Ramayana, the performances stage scenes of this epic which may last several nights and require up to 160 puppets for a single presentation. Many of them were destroyed under the repressive Khmer Rouge regime, which almost annihilated this secret art. Since 1979, Spike Tom has been gradually revitalized, thanks to the few surviving artists. The puppets are made from the single piece of leather in the special ceremony for each character representing gods and deities. The hides are dyed with a solution made from the bark of candle tree. The art design draws the desired feature on the tin hide, then cuts it out and paints it before attaching it to two bamboo sticks, enabling the dancer to control the puppet. The Spectrum figures are unlike puppets because they are large and heavy, with no movable parts. The Spectrum, in contrast, are much smaller puppets with movable parts. Their shows have been more popular. The Spectrum shadow play involves many puppeteers dancing on the screen. Each puppeteer playing one character of Ramayana while separate narrators recite the story accompanied by an orchestra. The Spectrum or Khmer Shadow Theater was inscribed in 2008 on the representative list of intangible cultural heritage of humanity, originally proclaimed in 2005. សិល្បៈជំនាញទៀបកសល់នឹងសម្បត្តិ